This video is about how to approach application problems with quadratics. Most application problems typically is looking for the maximum or the minimum value. That means that you need to look at whether the graph is opening up or opening down. And of course, if it's opening up, that means you're looking for a minimum. If it's opening down, you're looking for a maximum. We're looking at our first problem that is looking at how many CDs to sell to maximize revenue. So we want to maximize revenue. If we're going to maximize revenue, that is telling us that our parabola is opening down, which means we're going to be looking for the vertex point at the top of the quadratic. It gives us in the problem, as we read it, a uh, formula, the revenue equals 10x minus 0.01x squared. Now this looks very different than most quadratics that we've been working with, but all that we really need to know is that it is a quadratic, it is a negative in front of the x squared term, which also tells us that this is a quadratic that is opening down. So if we're looking for maximize, again, it verifies that it's opening down and we're looking for the tip of the vertex point. We typically want to use, uh, we could use any method where we change this to the vertex form of the equation, but typically it is easier to use that negative b over 2a formula to find the x part of the vertex. So negative b in this case would be the 10 and the a would be the negative 0.01. So we would have negative 10 over 2 times negative 0.01 and we would evaluate that negative 10 over 2 times negative 0.01 which gives us negative 0.02 and then that negative 10 over negative 0.02 evaluates to 500. So we were looking at how many CDs would it take to maximize revenue and so this is telling us X is representing the number of CDs, so it's telling us that we would need to sell 500 CDs to maximize our revenue. Now, if in your problem it also continued to ask maybe perhaps what would that revenue be? We would take the 500 and plug it into that formula and find the revenue by 10 times 500 minus 0 0.01 times 500 squared and evaluate that and that would tell us that the revenue would be $2,500. So depending on what your application problem is asking for, is it only asking for the amount to maximize it? Is it asking for the revenue, which would be the end result after we find the X value? The point of the vertex would be 500, 2500 to graphically look at that. And Again, it does vary depending on your problem, but basically we're looking at whether it is a maximum or minimum, and we're usually typically looking for the max or min point or the vertex point of that problem. So 
use this negative b over 2a to find the x value of the vertex point and then we can take that value and plug into the quadratic to find the y value of the vertex point.